Hi Aries, welcome back to the channel. It's always a blessing to have you guys here. If you're new here, welcome. And if you are in fact returning to my channel, welcome back. You know you're a diamond. Please continue to shine bright and beautiful like a diamond. All right, you guys, I'm going to get into a quick pray because a pray is always a must here on the channel, okay? This is just going to be an overall one. I want to see what's really going on with your situation, whether it's a past, a present, or a future one, okay? Let's pray. Heavenly Father, as I come before, I ask for your blessings for myself and for my secrets. Heavenly Father, please send your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading using my body as a vessel, giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share with the ones that need to know. Heavenly Father, I do give you all the honor and all the praise. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, y'all. Just know that this is a general reading and it's not a personal one. So with that being said, it may resonate with you and then again, it may not. Um, please take what does resonate with you at this moment, Aries, and leave the absolute rest, okay? The roles are always reversing. Please keep that in mind. I really don't want you guys to force the reads because it is not meant to be forced. Now, if you are also here and you're a cross watcher, same applies to you guys also. And if you are interested in having a personal reading with me, personal reading is definitely available on the channel. All you have to do to connect with me is to check in the description of the video and you'll see how to connect with me to have a personal reading done. Okay. All right, let's see what's going on here. All right, and just answer this quick guys, my eye ups, my guys. What's the message here, please? At this time for Aries, what is the overall energy pulling in for Aries? What is it that is needed to share with Aries at this present moment? All right, Aries, so we have we have the Eight of Wands in the reverse with the Eight of Swords in the reverse. Wow. There's so many things that is really going on right here with you right now in the now. For some of you, you may have been going through some things from the past. And it's like it's following you no matter what you do. It's like you can't catch a break. Okay, it's like you're not able to catch a break. I feel like whatever this is, is something that you've been, for some of you, it's been dealing with, you've been dealing with this for a very long time. Um, I really feel like there's a, a situation that feels very stuck. Or for some of you, it really feels like blockages. You know, it could be something that you really may have invested time in or something that you might have put a lot of love, sweat, and tears in. But what I do feel though, um, because there's so much blockages here and something that just feels like it's not moving or it's not going anywhere. I feel like you're really ready right here to kind of cut ties, cut the ties here. Um, because someone is feeling very burdened here, stressed out, um, very caged in, but I really feel like you're ready to release this caged feeling. Someone is just tired of being tapped into a situation that is really either touring, tearing you down or it's either tearing you apart here. But some of this causing these blockages. There's a lot of blockages here. Something is not moving here. But what is going on here? This eight, eight on eight. Okay, so you have the three of pentacles. The three of pentacles and knight of swords. And the Nine of Swords in the reverse with the Two of Swords also here. Whatever you might have been trying to invest into the situation, the situation seems like it doesn't require any more energy. I feel like you have done all that you could do. There's no communication. This person doesn't want to communicate. Maybe you guys are just not on talking terms. Or for some of you, you're just kind of sick and tired of, it, it feels like both ways. You're either sick and tired of them or they're sick and tired of you. Take it out, resonates with you. Um, but there's a release here, a releasing of a nine of swords energy. Um, whatever this boredom is or the sick and tired feeling is, this is all anxiety and stress and depression for some of you. On overload or overdrive here, someone seems to like to argue and fuss. This person comes with drama. This person comes with ego. 
This person is a force that is causing major chaos. Uh, what is going on? What is the Nine of Swords? The Knight of Swords. What is the Knight of Swords here, please? What is the Knight of Swords, please? The Death. Okay. So definitely something seems to be ending or needing to end or some kind of a change of some sort. Um, this could be a change to manifest your peace, joy, and hope here. Um, because you do have the three of cups in the reverse here, in, in the upright, what you didn't see coming. So there's something that is very toxic for you right now. I really feel like you have been carried a load here. Feeling loaded, overloaded and heavy burdened. Where someone is just not investing time and effort to make something happen here. Or are you feeling that this person is either wasting your time with the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse? What is the death? What is the death here, please? The Seven of Wands in the reverse. So this person is stuck. This person is stuck. This is why the change is not coming in um, the way that it should. The Wheel of Fortune here. But there's good luck here. There's good luck here with the Six of Cups energy here. Someone wants to reconciliate or something. Or somebody wants to come back or somebody wants to soak their royal oats or whatever is going on here. But there's something that is going to happen here. Okay, so this person is kind of reminiscing or having second thoughts or something but it already caused a dream to be ended i feel like that somebody's moving on already or already have for some of you might have tried to fix this knot but this knot at this time feels un, 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 unacceptable or unnotable all right yeah the strength confirmation this is taking a lot especially because this is also connected to a third party all right, so this is in the reverse. So you may have already known about this third party situation here, the Nine of Wands with the Three of Swords. A lot of stress here. Look at that. Very stressed out. Some of you feel like you're walking through the fire furnace here. The Five of Pentacles in the reverse. Okay, so you're recovering from this stress, a major loss or some kind of a takedown or meltdown. Or for some of you, you might have tried to do something to the situation. Maybe some of you tried to do a spell work or a love spell or something. That seems to be in the reverse. Meaning nothing really changed. Nothing, nothing really changed. This is what I'm picking up. All right. What is the seven of wands in the reverse with the death? What is the seven of wands here in the reverse with the death? I feel that the truth is about to come out. The four of pentacles. That truth is coming out. The four of pentacles and knight of pentacles in the reverse with the sun. That is coming out because whatever is in the dark is coming to light. That's on God. Okay. Um, the Ten of Swords and the Hermit in the reverse. So you find the clarity that you need. Even if you, even if it takes for you to be in isolation to get this clarity to find something new within yourself, this is what you're planning on doing here. All right, someone is just not there. This person may be very manipulative. Maybe this this person has such a huge ego. It's not even funny. All right, but you're not playing any more games with this person. The game is over. It's game over. The Three of Cups in the reverse. You know about there's a third party, a fear that's really gone wrong. Maybe this person didn't sign up for it to go that way, but it did. Now, I feel like this person wants you and you and, and you and you. And, oh. No, 
that's not going to happen ever yeah there's definitely blockages here the eight of swords in the reverse with the five of cups in the reverse major blockages here and i feel like this person is having a serious meltdown right now um i i i really feel like this person is definitely feeling really bad or just dealing with regrets or sadness or whatever maybe this is just a karmic payback a mental one all right the justice the justice and the ace of pentacles yeah this person is thinking about coming back maybe they want to start something new with you or something just coming in new but i say new i mean brand damn new spanking spanking new the nine of cups the nine of cups the page of swords it's a game of give and take here somebody has to make a massive decision about what it is that you want moving forward I feel like whatever it is that you've been manifesting, this is changing. It, you, it may appear that it's not changing fast enough, but it is. However, somebody keeps constantly going back to a situation that is connected to conflicts here. Arguments and conflicts. This person just likes to argue constantly, constantly. This person is connected to a lot of things that doesn't serve you any good. Then, now or never. The Queen of Pentacles in the reverse with the Ace of Swords in the reverse. This person is not ready to make any decisions yet. Because for some of you, they like it the way it is. The Page of Wands, the Six of Wands. There's a lot of fight, a lot of struggle, a lot of indecisive energy here. This is why you have the Tower here in the upright. Uh, the only thing that's causing is major arcanas in the entire situation here. But what I do see is you moving forward. You're moving forward. You're getting your life back on track. You're finding love. You're reminiscing to who's reminiscing with you. For some of you, you're either planning some kind of a vacation or something. You want to go away alone. Maybe you just want to do this by yourself to find love. Love is coming in is what I'm seeing here. Someone is, is, this could be someone that you might have already known. I mean, this could be friendships or whatever that you rekindling here. All right, but there's doubts. Someone just feels that like they can't be alone. Why is this? Someone just feels that like they have to have someone there all the time. All right, clarify this, please. The Four of Swords, the Ace of Cups. What is that, please? With the Page of Swords and the Nine of Cups. Ten of Pentacles manifesting one's life right here. Somebody's just ready to start over. I feel like for some of you, it might not be really getting along with family or friends or whatever. You really feel like, you know, you've really been putting in the work and somebody does not have been meeting you halfway or whatever is going on here. This is because that connection is just tied up to toxicity. Um, gossip, lies, conflicts, and betrayal. I feel like somebody is either trying to learn tarot or something, but not really sure how to go about it. And somebody's still being indecisive. What is this all about? There's so many conflicted energy that is trying to come through all at the same time. But I keep hearing take time, take your time, take time, or it's going to take time, don't rush, or something, something like that. I just feel like there's something that you're going to find out. I just feel like there's some kind of information that is coming through that you're going to find out about Aries, the Page of Cups, Energy with the Nine of Pentacles. This has a lot to do with your growth and what you decide to give to yourself and finding a place of peace here. The Ace of Swords in the reverse, Major Arcana, setbacks, stumbling blocks, roadblock, the Five of Cups also in the reverse. It's not for you to take on this person's pain because you already tried it and took all the strength that you had in you. The Six of Pentacles, some of you is really, really not trying to go back to that place where judgment is. You're going to have to let judgment do what they have, what, what it really does. Somebody is either talking about separation permanently or somebody is ready to just take situations to the damn courts 
to the judge or whatever. Let the judge deal with it because it's something that's maybe out of control or, you know, you don't know how to control it anymore. Something's just lost this way. Somebody's about to have a meltdown or you already had one. Somebody's either taking something to calm their nerves or something. Somebody's losing or feels like they are. What is this? The world. Time that you shine. The world is yours. Okay. Good karma is coming in towards you. You're healing from this ten of swords. That's in the reverse. Um, this could be the divorce or something. Okay. But you're healing from this major betrayal. The seven of swords in the reverse. You're done. You're finding out this person for who they truly are. The mask is coming the hell off. Once and for all. And you're getting this good ass karma. And they're mad about it. The Wheel of Fortune, the Six of Cups, all that's coming towards is nothing but victory with the Page of Wands energy. Because you're standing your grounds. You're standing your ground, the Nine of, the nine of Cups. And somebody really wants to tag a situation, a situation along with them. I feel like somebody needs to know that you cannot take anything with you. Okay? This Nine of Cups, is it's, it's going to be either or. Somebody just feels like it's... It, it, Three should be a damn crowd all the time. All right. The four of wands in the reverse. Yeah, that's going to cause major kind of once again. With the lovers been here and the, and the four of wands, y'all. Okay, that's not going to work. That is not a good idea. Somebody going to have to make a choice. Okay, you're either going to choose them or me. Or me or them. All right, tell me more. Okay, the Queen of Cups energy in the reverse with the Emperor. So somebody's being a loser here, okay? Somebody is a loser and they're trying to have you being just as low as they are. It's not going to work, all right? With the devil being here, that's straight toxicity. The Eight of Pentacles in the reverse. It's a hell freaking no. No, I don't know. You are not going to have this person suck the life source out of you, okay? You have cried enough. This is what I'm hearing. You have cried enough damn tears. Wipe your tears and get ready for what's coming. I'm seeing you releasing this person's energy. Feeling stuck. Feeling like there's no room to breathe. Somebody's trying to escape this mask. But this person is so slick like a fox. Oh my goodness, what the hell is this? The Nine of Pentacles once again with the Three of Wands in the reverse. This is all fear. Somebody's just af afraid of the unknown. Afraid, oh my goodness. Just remaining in a place where the, this place is just dark, dark and dingy. It's just dark and damn dingy. Their life is dark and dingy, and their purpose is to make sure that your life stays dark and dingy. dingy. But I'm here to tell y'all that is not possible. That is not part of the plan, God's plan. That is not a part of your purpose. That is not a part of your mission here, okay? You ain't signed up for that. You did not sign up for that. You know what? Let me use my deck, you guys, because I have not used my deck in forever. And I've just been called to pull some messages from my deck. If you guys are interested in purchasing my deck, I still have a few available for purchase. Um, the information to get my deck is also in the description of this video, okay? Alright, let's see. Alright, I'm going to spend answers. Oh, I got hiccups. <laughs> Holy Spirit, ancestors, spirit guides. What's the messages here for Aries, please? What is the messages here? Only important messages for Aries. Holy Spirit, ancestors, my guides, my eye ups. What is the message here, please, for Aries? What is it that Aries needs to know right now? All right. 
All right, so we have we get we're having commitment here. So somebody's definitely afraid of commitment. I feel like you have to trust your intuition moving forward. Um, this person is saying that I'm I'm tired of of guessing. Okay, so you're either tired of guessing how this person really feels or this is them. But I'm seeing a return. This tells me that it may be some kind of a return, some kind of an unfinished business, some kind of a reconciliation. Um, or somebody might have missed an opportunity because there's still a conflicted energy that feels very juggled here or smuggled. I want you, I want you to choose. So you want this person to choose because you're ready for change. You're tired of the same thing with this person. Something new, fertility here. I was my own mistake, yet you still love me. So this person might have made several mistakes with your heart and caused turmoil here. But you still love this person regardless. But some of you still do. Even if you guys are in separation or you're in no contact, I really feel like you're still loving this person. All right. Tell me more. Okay. So we have pride here. It's coming through for some of you guys. All right. Um, hopelessness. The pride is a feeling of hopelessness. Okay. I can't tell you everything right now, but I do care. So this person say, I do, I do care. I just can't tell you. This person really wants to confess. All right. It's more like picking up the five of cups energy where this person is feeling very embarrassed to tell you what's really going on. Please let me explain. Um, however, my pride gets in the way here. Okay. So this may be some addiction. The addiction could be a sexual addiction because I see the third party here. The third party 777 did come through. So this could be some kind of an addiction that this person is going through as far as a sexual one is concerned. This person could either be dealing with their sexual sexuality. This is why I'm getting forgiveness also. This person may want your forgiveness. Um, for some of you, your intuition may have already told you that this person is struggling with your sexuality. Or, 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 or this is you. Okay, this is in the reverse. Okay, conflicted. Conflicted abandonment and release. I need time to offer you the true commitment that you need. I have a secret, but I don't want it to ruin things between us. Okay, so this person wants some kind of a new beginning, but I feel like they already uh, ghosted the relationship. Uh, for some of you, this could be a marriage. If they're not married to you, they're married to someone else. But I see this person being a runner here. This love is not giving me nothing but stress. So somebody's very stressed out. I feel like there's a distance. That, that song says there's distance between us. So there's definitely distance here. Um, time to clean your spiritual zone. This is what the angels are saying. It's time. Um, because this resistance is having you feeling very overwhelmed here. Um, love me now or lose me forever. That's on God. All right. Divine time is at play. Cloudy judgment. Something seems to be moving, but not really moving at the same damn time. I want to come clean, but I need a determination. There you go. That's confirmation. Somebody is not moving or this is you. Okay. Whatever is going on, it is a love situation that's in the reverse. Tell me more. I'm here loyalty. Tell me more. All right, so this turmoil that's coming in, it feels more like a storm warning here, but there's definitely conflicts that's coming in with this turmoil. Someone is choosing to block something off, not wanting to see a situation for what it really is. I'm struggling to communicate how I really feel, but wanting to release something here. Someone wants to have peace within the situation. I walked or I talked about you. Um, please let me um, say I'm sorry. So this person said that they might have told your business, run your name under the mud with other people. Um, and this is why the cloudy judgment is coming through. Um, this they may have suffered some kind of a consequence already because of this hate or just out of being spiteful. Enough is enough. Somebody feels very caught up in a bottle or trapped in a bottle here because of this bitterness. I'm seeing the clouds and the thunderstorms. Somebody's definitely going through something. Be careful how you share with the enemy. So now you're wondering, damn, is this person my friend or what? Who the hell are you? Because I don't know who you are at this point. Karma got you when you broke my heart, okay, without closure. So this person might have ghosted you without any closure. Whatever they did, see, so yeah, they caused separation here. Definitely separation that's coming in that definitely connected to anxiety. For some of you guys, you definitely face some kind of an anxiety that you might have experienced with this entire outcome 
All right, let's see. All right, what is this for, Aries, please? What's really going on? Okay, so loyalty. Loyalty and a curse. All right, so that seems to be confirmation about that damn gossip that's happening here. Untold truth that's never ending. So somebody's just not telling the truth. This person's intentions is bad, but as far as loyalty is concerned, um, I'm blessed to meet you, but um, I'm committed to another. This person is dealing with somebody else, okay? This is causing confusion. This person stays watching you, or this is their third party who's watching you. Um, there's some kind of a delay here. The five of pentacles here, abandonment. You left me for dead when I needed you the damn most, okay? Somebody is causing tension with the eight of swords energy, anxiety on God, all right? And addictions on God. All right, um, something very unexpected might have happened with this family situation, this family dyna dynamic. Uh, maybe somebody just decided to kind of ghost this family dynamic or, or, or whatever. Somebody felt like maybe they had to leave when they could or anxiety and stress, period. Empress energy is here, manifestation, past life, love, set, let, set in my power and let you go for good. Okay, because you're causing anxiety and stress in my damn life. All right, let's see. Hidden secrets, abandonment, uh, spine again, and a player that's in the damn reverse. I feel that this player caused the separation, though. You have to use your intuition in the situation because it's calling for you to use your intuition because if you don't, then something shocking is going to happen. I already know that there's blockages here, but there's something shocking that will come through. But I feel like you have the power within you, Aries, to stop these a shocking situation from shocking the hell out of you. Okay, tell me more. Whatever is happening here is happening, okay? Somebody's causing these major comments to be uh, unnecessary. It's like these major comments could be prevented, but somebody is just walking into from one major to the next major. Constantly, back to back to back. All right, abandonment, mystery. So this person is definitely a mystery here, okay? You really don't know who, who this is. You may think you know, but you don't. Divine intervention is coming through because this person is distracted. Uh, what is this loyalty and this curse here, please? Okay, so you're trying to find peace within the situation. All right, water, cancer, Scorpio. Signs, Pisces, boundaries is needed, y'all. Can we have a threesome? I love you even more. Okay. This person is lusting. So what do you, regardless you give into this threesome or not, they're going to do it regardless. I can't be faithful, but I can be good in bed. Okay. Okay. I can't be faithful, but I could be good in bed, though. And I mean, let me do what I do. Separation, resistance, and mistakes. So this person know that they definitely caught, did some stupid stuff here. I'm seeing witchcraft for some of you stuck in a situation of spell. You may feel that this person might have done something, or maybe you did. Finally, broken, uh, divine timing, and distraction. Somebody is thinking. Somebody is really thinking over time here. If this ain't you, Aries, that's thinking your ass off, this is this twin flame person who's thinking their ass off. But somebody still seems to be a mystery here, attached to a mystery. Why do you still feel the need to hold on to me, though? Okay, regret in the reverse and cleansing in the upright. All right, spiritual awakening. So whatever is happening here, I feel like somebody has been dreaming things. Just think, you just listen. You be going through some things, okay? And somebody's not using those things like they should. You just think it's just a friction of your imagination. Well, I'm here to tell you what it was not. That's your ancestor giving you the damn signs to put on your your running shoes, your jogging shoes, or whatever. However you feel comfortable, okay? The time the clock is ticking for something shocking to come through. Abandonment, broken, and... In 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 foundation that's in the reverse. 
All right, clarify this last thing, please. Because somebody's somebody's on the edge. Somebody is definitely on the edge here. Healing. Healing is needed, okay? Whatever is going on here where somebody is on the edge, there's definitely healing. That's that's needed, okay? Healing is needed. You can't do it by yourself. Fix it for me. Like only God can do. Fix it for me. Lord, I have a problem that only you can solve. And I know. Fix it for me. Only he can fix it, honey. All right, tell me more. All right, mystery. He's going to fix that mystery. Resistant, trickery, and fog in the reverse. This fog is having me feel like somebody life is on standby. Somebody definitely put somebody on standby. And it's still in separation, no matter what. If it's not a separation, it's a no contact. This empress is empressing out. This empress is saying, listen, I'm ready for this manifestation. I'm seeing pregnancy. I'm seeing past life, love, settling. I'm setting my power and I'm letting your ass go for good. Somebody is, is f figuring out their word. Okay. This empress is saying, I'm done. I don't, I'm tired of this shocking feeling here and dealing with blockages. I am just tired. Okay. Tired of being tired. Tired of being sick and damn tired. All right, separation here. Mistakes were made. Um, somebody's still dealing with silence here, or um, some of you just dealing with clouded judgment or on something very unexpected that is draining the hell out of your energy. Energy, but you still want to walk away, but still stuck. Or this is them. I'm seeing values here. Expecting something. Somebody's working on their money or need to. This could be a career choice, job, or some kind of a promotion or something. Um, you have too many differences. Okay, so there's a lot of differences here. You may be on a money walk and they on the, uh, a different kind of a walk. Okay, a flirtatious player type of a walk. I'm giving you what you gave me. Wish you're not giving this person anything more because you're not telling them the truth. Neither are they ready to give the clarity. Ear sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, take it out, resonates, beginnings, distance, um, time to clear your spiritual zone because there's too much damn confusion and tension. Conflicts are overtaking me, but you're all that I see. Okay. This is ego, you guys. Somebody's taking a risk here. Somebody's like, only you, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. All right, hidden secrets. Betrayal lies that makes you feel overwhelmed because this person has too many differences with you. All right, what's this? All right, all right, only you. So this person said, okay, I, I wouldn't want to be with you, but hey, this earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, rooted and grounded, but I need to let, I let, need to let you come over, but we have hidden secrets here. What is this in secrets here? What's this secret? Because, honey, baby, honey, baby, the hidden secret stress. You said you love me, but you damn lied. So you're finally finding out, Aries, that this person is lying. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Like, yeah, so many lies, okay? And I feel like these lies are really getting caught up to this person. There's nothing more to say because you already know. You already know that this person is lying. So now they're like, oh shit. <laughs> did I do that? Did I say that? Yes, you did. 
You're getting deeper and deeper into your own web. This person knows that they made a mistake with you and they know that they broke in the relationship and make you feel like you can't trust anybody ever again. Feeding drained and forgetting your purpose for some of you guys. Even though you know that there's blockages with this person, you're still holding on to this egoistic player energy. Uh, some of you have been tricked that this is your twin flame, your soulmate. All right, but this person is juggling something and causing major distraction. If they're not thinking about you, this person is definitely thinking about that third party that came through earlier. That 777, honey, three's a damn crowd. All right, there's regrets here. They feel so ashamed, but because of this ego, they're having a hard time saying, I'm sorry. Okay, their way of saying, I'm sorry, is to make some kind of a love. Okay, that is not enough. All right, divine intervention is saying it's not enough. Okay, healing is needed, is what you need. If somebody needs to come clear to tell the truth, I've, I'm nice, but I wear a mask on the low. What I tell you? Look at that. I'm nice, but I wear a mask on the low. Fix it for me. Lord, I have a problem that only you can solve. And I beg you, fix it for me. Fix it for me. Mm, fix it for me, Lord. Time that you start planting some damn seeds. Okay. Looking for clarity, but you have to plant these seeds. Maybe you need to take your, yourself out of the situation. Maybe you have to walk alone. Okay, like the chief stands alone. Maybe that's what you need so that way you can heal from this ten of swords. Or whatever. This change needs to come very fast, but for you, this is in the reverse. Okay, so there's definitely stoppages and blockages or whatever that is. Somebody's acting like a fool. Like a, like something caught between a rock and a hard damn place. Causing major, major arcanas here. Having you walk into a tower moment, like how many towers can you take? Before you flip the hell out. Because somebody's about to get hurt really, really badly here. This indecisive energy is causing major damn sadness here and pain. All right, you guys, I'm going to end this one here. Um, I just got in from outside. I had to go grab something to eat, you guys, because I was so hungry. So I went and got me some habanero chicken wings. And your girl is full. So I'm going to go watch a movie. I'm going to upload this video. It is a Saturday. I hate to say days in my videos these days because I hate to, I don't want to timestamp my videos or nothing. Timestamp, day, time, no kind of stamp. You get it when you get it. However you get it. Five years from now, ten years from now, whatever you get it, that's when you get it, okay? So I don't want to put dates and day in my videos anymore. Okay, but yeah, but it is Saturday though. Um, Saturday night that is. I am going to shut the energy down, not do no more reads for the night. Um, for those of you guys that has made um an appointment for personal tomorrow and Monday, we're gonna have to play catch up on Tuesday because tomorrow I won't be able to do any personals. Neither would I able neither would I be able to do any personals on Monday. Alright. Um, because I have to take my daughter um apartment shopping on Monday. So we're gonna have to pay catch up on Tuesday. So I'm sorry you guys for the inconvenience or whatever, but I got you. I got you. Okay? I got you. Alright, you guys, that is it. Um please go ahead and hit that like button if you have not done so already. Um, also, if you do need to have a prayer request, just tell me that you need one simply by leaving your initials for yourself or for your family or for your person, passport, whoever. 
just leave their initials in the comments okay if you have not subscribed subscribe and if you have not joined the membership go ahead and join it is only four dollars and 99 cents to join and you can cancel at any time also please come over and subscribe to my channel life is juliana and also to my cooking channel how to cook channel i see you guys over there and don't forget to say hello in the comments i love you guys so 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 much all right i'll see you guys tomorrow for another one until then always remember to seek first and you always slide bye guys later